Aren't these surroundings beautiful? Man, I tell you, it's gorgeous out here. I heard a story one time about some guys that got together, some friends got together to go hunting. And they went out and they agreed to go out in pairs so that they'd care for one another, make sure everybody was okay, and that they'd meet back in the evening at the cabin. Well, they all met back at the cabin, except this one guy came in alone and he was carrying this big old buck, eight point buck over his back, struggling under the weight of it. And they asked him, they said, hey, nice catch, but where's Harry, his partner, where's Harry? And he said, well, I'm pretty sure Harry broke his ankle. Anyways, I had to leave him up the trail a ways because I had to bring the buck back. And they said, what do you mean you left Harry? Why did you leave Harry and bring back the buck? And he said, well, I just figured nobody's going to steal Harry, <laughs> right? Sometimes our choices are determined by our priorities. In fact, most times our choices are determined by our priorities. Well, Jesus speaks to this fact in uh, probably the most famous message ever delivered by the most famous preacher ever delivering a message, Jesus himself. We call it the Sermon on the Mount. And he teaches somewhere in that Sermon on the Mount, and we're gonna take a look at that this Sunday, about how our priorities impact our choices. And he invites us to consider a new way of prioritizing. So come join us this Sunday at nine or 11 a.m. and we'll discover together how Jesus' plan for putting first things first changes everything.